Good morning, Patriots. Today is Wednesday, May 16th. And you are tuning into your Patriot Press News. Three, two, one. I'm Raina McRitchie. I'm Samantha Lopez. And here is this morning's announcements. Dance team tryouts for the 2018-2019 school year are this week, May 15th through the 18th, in the dance room at 3.30. See Ms. Burns for any information and applications. On Monday, the Sunbelt League selected a coach of the year. We are proud to share with you that our own baseball coach, Mr. Scott Montgomery, was chosen. His dedication to our students and his commitment to our program have been exemplary. Coach Montgomery has accomplished this and has done a great job standing out as a phenomenal coach. We want to take the time to, congratu to congratulate Coach Montgomery and thank him for his hard work and dedication. Congrats, Coach! Election for next year's ASL officers will be on Tuesday, 529 in room W105 after school. We are still accepting candidates for positions of president, vice president, historian, secretary, and treasurer as well. As well as ASL clubs still have shirts and hoodies for sale at ASB. $10 for t-shirts and $20 for hoodies with zippers. If you are interested in going to the Museum of Tolerance in Los Angeles on May 25th, please see Miss Hunter in Washington 103 by this Friday. This is open to all students, so if you are learning about the Holocaust or want to go along, see Miss Hunter this week. Did you hear that PLUS students are rolling out their very own TED Talk just for us? For the entire school where we will be invited to go to the theater and hear their inspirational and motivating speeches about their stories and how courage helped them overcome hate, self-harm, suicidal thoughts, racism, and many other heartfelt stories. So Patriots, here's a glimpse of a TED Talk and be ready to come and witness one life by your very own peers. What a better way to recognize May as Mental Health Month. Tell your daughters of this year how we woke needing coffee, but discovered instead cadavers strewn about our morning papers, waterlogged facsimiles of our sisters, spouses, small children. Say to your baby of this year when she asks, as she certainly should, tell her it was too late coming. Admit, even in the year we leased freedom, we didn't own it outright. There were still laws for every way we used our privates while they pawed at the soft folds of us, grabbed with no concern for consent, no laws made for the men that enforced them. We were trained to dodge, to wait, to cower and cover, to wait more, still wait. We were told to be silent. That is just an intro to an amazing poem by Chanika Hodge. You can follow the link below to watch the rest. So there you have it, Patriots. This motivating day will take place on Wednesday, May 30th, which is Mental Health Awareness Day. During lunch, there will be a DJ and games to partake in with plenty of resources about mental health and even ice cream for sale. Enjoy all of the activities the mental health fair has to offer and don't forget to wear green. But the fun doesn't stop when school ends. From four to six in the flex room, your art department's having its annual art show with works from Ms. Bryan and Ms. Clough students. So make sure to check it out. Immediately after is the very first ever media art showcase held in the theater lobby and theater. You are invited to this red carpet formal attire event where photography students will showcase their best photos from six to seven where you can have the chance to vote for photo of the year. And then from seven to nine, video production students will have their films shown on the big screen in the theater. Patriots, that is our announcement for this Wednesday. Next week is the last spirit week and we will let this video from ASB play us out. Have a great day.